Hey everyone, this is Chase of Rocky Mountain ATVMC giving you a closer look at the 50S Bluetooth communicator from Cena. All right, everyone, thanks for checking in. So today we're giving you a closer look at the 50S Bluetooth communicator from Cena. This is the latest addition in the Cena lineup. You had the 30K, which we saw come out a while ago, which introduced their new mesh technology, which is pretty cool. If you haven't yet, you can watch that product spotlight. The 30K is not going anywhere, but now with the 50S and there's a 50R model, which I'll talk about, which is gonna be the exact same price. There's very subtle differences between the two, which I will talk about, but there's about a $40 price jump going from the 30K up to the 50S or the 50R. So we're gonna go through today, we're gonna to talk about what is new with this, what are the big updates, and maybe why you'd wanna spend the extra money and go with the 50S or the 50R, or if you already have a 30K, maybe this video will help you decide, you know what, I like what I got, I'm gonna stick with it, I'll wait for something else to come out. So. Like I said, the 30K came out not too long ago, it introduced a new mesh technology from Cena, which I believe is a must have now with Bluetooth communicators. We use these things excessively on our adventure rides. They are a must have. It is so much better when you're able to talk to other riders in your group. It's a safety factor to be able to know exactly what's going on. I think it just makes the rides much more enjoyable. Also, while you're talking to people, you can stream your favorite music. You can get voice commands from your GPS. So there's a lot of cool technology packed into these that make your riding experience much more enjoyable. And what's cool about the mesh technology is that with traditional Bluetooth communicators, if you're connected to one rider or multiple riders, if you lose signals with somebody, you'd have to stop and repair and reconnect to that individual. With the mesh technology, what it'll do, let's paint a scenario here, it's you and say two other riders, one rider falls back, he drops out of range, you lose that connection. You and your other buddy, can still talk to each other and communicate as if nothing changed. When that third rider comes back into range, that mesh communication will automatically repair or reconnect that person to your group so you start talking again as if nothing ever changed. We love the mesh technology. It is worth having if you don't have it already, if you ride in groups because of that feature. It is phenomenal. It makes it so much better. No more headache of having to stop and then repair if you do lose a signal. As far as the 50S and the unit is concerned, it is water resistant. It's not waterproof. Just something to keep in mind there. The battery life on these is really good. With the 50S, you're about nine hours of mesh communication talking time and 14 hours of Bluetooth. What's cool too is that with the new 50S is that your charge time is very quick. In about an hour, you get a full charge. They also have their quick 20 minute charge to where in 20 minutes, you can get about three hours of mesh communication, about five hours of Bluetooth. So if you just need to squeeze a little bit extra juice, you can recharge it real quick, get a lot of extra talking time, and you can charge us while you are riding. So that's what's cool about the mesh and what's kind of cool about this unit. now. Here's what's changed with the 50S from the 30K, just to kind of give you an idea of what the big updates are. So the charge time is one, we've already covered that. The other is that with the mesh, you now have mesh 2.0, and what they've done is just taken that technology and they've refined it a little bit. And what they say is that they get about 25% faster communication. In other words, if you have a group of people all talking at the same time, as I start to talk, you're just gonna hear me come through a little bit quicker, it's just a little bit more intuitive. So they just refine things to make everything flow and have that data go back and forth a little bit more seamlessly. And then as far as Bluetooth goes, another big update is you are now Bluetooth 5.0 versus 4.1. And with that, that's just gonna allow you to connect your other devices a little bit faster. Again, we're just talking small refinements to make everything flow a little bit easier to give you the best technology possible. Another cool feature about the 50S that is new is that with the charger, there is a Wi-Fi adapter built in. So as long as there's Wi-Fi available when you're charging your unit, if there is an update available, it will automatically update it for you. So those are some of the big updates with the 50S or the 50R again, which we'll talk about. But if you already have the 30K, just know that feature-wise and technology, you're getting essentially just about everything that you would with the 50S and 50R, just some of the small difference that we just mentioned. So that's gonna be up to you to decide you know, if you're looking at the two, do you want to spend the extra about 40 bucks and go up to the 50S, 50R, or save that money and go with the 30K? That's going to come down to rider preference. Now, as far as the unit itself, like I said, not going to be waterproof. Keep that in mind. But here's the differences between the 50S and the 50R. So the 50S is what I have on the table. You can see I've got one installed right here. The 50S uses the jog wheel. You got your flip-up antenna. 
Now with the 50R, it's a little bit more low profile. And instead of having the jog wheel on the side, you have three buttons. I like the jog wheel just for the fact that with the gloved hand, it's easy. It's easy to find this, it's easy to use it, very easy to feel when you're doing that. With the 50R, if you're wanting something that's gonna be more low profile, that would be the better option because as far as mounting goes, with the 50S, you're using the clamshell mount that will come included, but with the 50R, you've got a couple, you've got two options. You can mount it directly to the helmet or use the clamp style mount. So if you go directly to the helmet, it makes it a little bit more low profile. But here's something that you would want to keep in mind. Between the 50S and the 50R, the battery time isn't going to be the same. You're about an hour less of Bluetooth and about an hour less of mesh communication. So those are really the big differences. Aside from that technology-wise, you're going to get everything out of both of these. As far as your range with these, you're about 1.2 miles rider to rider. That's best case scenario. That's you and a friend are on the highway. You can see each other. Yeah, you can maximize that range. But you gotta remember, line of sight really comes into play. If one rider is around a bend, over the hill, you're in a wooded area, you can't see the other rider, it is going to reduce that range drastically. So there's something to keep in mind. But if you're using mesh communication and you have a big group that you're riding with, you can definitely extend that range. In fact, they say about a five mile range in mesh mode with this, as long as you have, I believe, five or six riders in that group, it will just kind of daisy chain and use all the units to communicate with each other. But like I said, that's best case scenario. That's when, you know, basically all riders can see each other that you're gonna get that five mile range. But with that mesh, like I said, that's what's cool about it is that if the rider at the lead of the pack, he goes off, he loses reception or communication with the group. As soon as he's back within range, he rejoins as if nothing had ever happened. That's what's cool about that mesh technology. Now in these things, there's a lot that they can do. What I would definitely recommend, because I'm gonna give you the most important things that I would want you to know if you were looking at this, definitely go make sure you read the product page because there's a lot of cool technologies baked into these things. There's a learning curve too. When you buy this, don't just assume it's thrown on your helmet, go rock and roll. But what's nice though is that over the years, we've seen it get much easier and easier because now you have apps. So when you get this, download the Cena app. The Cena app is specific to the unit you have, so make sure you get the right one. But once you've done that, it's actually pretty easy using the app. You just use your phone. That allows you to control everything, get all your settings set up, get everything exactly how you want it. So it does make it pretty seamless. Some other cool features about that mesh. You can have your mesh communication. You can have up to six riders talking all at the same time, but you can have essentially limitless amounts of riders who can hear the conversation going. So you can get some massive groups that can go and all connect to each other when you're riding with this. And also what's cool is that with the touch of a button, it will automatically connect to anybody in the area that does have that mesh technology with a Cena unit. Now let's say you have a friend who has an older Cena model that doesn't have the mesh technology. What's cool is that you can still have your mesh group, but at the same time, you can still pair to other Bluetooth devices, even a non Cena unit. So if you have somebody who wants to join the group who's not a part of the 50S club or the 30K club, it's okay. They can still connect via Bluetooth. Aside from that, you're gonna know the features that you would expect in the Bluetooth communicator. You're gonna get your music streaming. And what's cool too is that when you start to talk, you can set this thing up so that the volume will automatically lower when you start to talk. Somebody talks to you, the volume will automatically lower. It'll automatically lower when you're going at slower speeds. It will get a little bit louder and going to higher speeds. Again, you can customize this thing, get everything set up exactly how you want it. And when you are having that mesh group, everyone's talking all at the same time, you can still be connected to your GPS or your smartphone and get commands from those as well. Again, these are features and benefits that we've been seeing for a while now, but you're still getting all of that. The big updates now is just the more refined mesh, the Bluetooth 5.0, the charge time is about 30% faster, along with some of the other cool features that you're getting with the 50S or the 50R. Now, a few more things that I do wanna point out that I like about the 50S and the 50R is voice commands. These things are essentially hands-free and with the 50S and 50R couldn't be more true because now you can say, hey Google, hey Siri, and these will allow you to do voice commands that way. The 30K, you don't have that ability. You now have that with the 50S and the 50R. Now, as far as your mics go, each of these are gonna come with a boom mic and a wired mic. That's gonna be rider preference. Boom mic might be a little bit better if you have a modular helmet, so the mic's always there if you had that the front of the helmet up. You could use a wired mic if you're rocking a full face helmet. Again, that's gonna come down to rider preference. And last thing I do wanna point out is you do have the ability on the front here. These both come with excellent speakers. They're a little bit more refined and they are gonna be better sounding than the previous speakers I've seen they used. But 
you do have the option to rock your own headphones with a three and a half millimeter jack that you have on that clamp if you want to take that route. All right, and that is it. That is the 50S Bluetooth communicator from Sina. Hopefully today I have answered some of your questions that you may have had. If I haven't yet, leave your questions, your comments below. We want to help you out. We want to make this very clear for you. And to see these and all the other Bluetooth communicators that we offer, you can click on the link or head over to rockymountainatvmc.com. As always, orders are over $75 ship free. If you guys like this product spotlight, you want to see more like it, make sure to subscribe to the Rocky Mountain YouTube channel, hit that notification bell, and stay up to date. I am Chase, and we'll see you on the trails.